I am not a liar. I have killed thousands. I have fed more drug fiends than the top three pharmaceutical companies combined. I have stolen children from parents, wives from husbands, wiped out entire generations. But lying, that I have never done. The rest are offenses against humanity. Lying is an offense against yourself. I am the head of the Santa Blanca organization. Which you call a cartel. I had a dream. I dreamed of a land where we could grow our own coca. Produce our own cocaine. Where we could run our business free from interference from the police. The government. The army. The Yankees. In my dream, a woman's voice asked me. Sueño, mijo, what if you had your own country? Like Moses, I led my people to the promised land, Bolivia. We came here. We bought the coca fields. What we couldn't buy, we took. We bought the police, the military, the judges, the politicians. We were on the verge of becoming the government itself. On the razor's edge from fulfilling my dream. Of creating a narco state. The nation of Santa Blanca. Last week, a crude explosive detonated outside the U.S. Embassy in La Paz, Bolivia. Two Marine Embassy guards were injured in the blast. Two days later, a CIA asset in central Bolivia provided us with these images. Our analysts have identified the individual in the photo as DEA Special Agent Ricardo Ricky Sandoval, my friend. Sandoval has had spent the last six years investigating the local cocaine industry. Our understanding is that Sandoval was the intended target of the bombing. What the embassy bomb did not accomplish was completed up close and personal. Sandoval was captured, tortured, and killed. Then his body was dumped. We have yet to recover it. Our target, the group responsible for the embassy bombing and the death of Special Agent Sandoval, is the drug trafficking organization commonly known as the Santa Blanca Cartel. Yesterday, they were just narcos. Today, they're narco-terrorists. Initially, the Bolivian government resisted the Mexican cartel. They formed UNIDAD, a Bolivian special forces unit. It didn't go as planned. Thousands of bodies later, politicians, police officers, and journalists have become an endangered species. The Bolivian government has imploded on itself. With no other options, the new president made a deal with Santa Blanca. You stop killing our people, we'll look the other way. Since then, Santa Blanca has turned Bolivia into the nexus of the South American drug trade. With their friends in Mexico, they also have a clear pipeline to the US and Canada. The only way to stop Santa Blanca for good is to completely dismantle them, piece by piece. The cartel is organized into four operations. Production, smuggling, security, and influence. At the top of it all is El Jefe de los Jefes, Boss of bosses, El Sueño. say it comes with a job, but it doesn't get any easier. No, it doesn't. Guess you've been down here a while? I've been living as Karen Bowman, international aid worker, for just about five years. 
means living rough, but as a cover, it gets me out and about. At least it comes with a chopper. How'd you get in country? I flew in business class from Manaus. Hey, I'm refreshed and ready for work, right? I just hitched rides from Barranco, Peru. How about you? I got on board a bus in Huey, Argentina, and drank all the way to Via Zone. Nobody wants to deal with a drunk on the bus. That explains why you smell like ass. I've heard rumors about you guys. I was a rookie field officer in Moscow when the coup went down. There was talk you were involved? Nah, it must have been someone else. We were never there. It's not every day you get to meet an urban legend in the flesh. Huh, you should tell that to my kid. Maybe he'd listen when I tell him to take the trash out. Is it hard being someone who doesn't officially exist? You tell me, Karen Bowman, international aid worker. I'm sure you've seen the horrible, fucked up shit humans are capable of when there are zero repercussions. But let me tell you right now, no matter how you compartmentalize, how you desensitize, you can't prepare for El Sueño. He's got a religious streak that rates pretty close to delusional. He's taken vows of poverty, chastity. If he's not in it for the chocha or the money, he's in it for the power. This joint task force is CIA, DEA, JSOC. I'm your resident spook for this ride. Welcome to Operation Kingslayer. Our briefing said there'd be a contention of locals. The guitar is 26. They're a group of rebels who've been giving Unidad and Santa Blanca some resistance. We'll meet their leader, Pacatari, as soon as we touch down. Bolivians have a long history of hating us Yankees, but this time, let's hope the enemy of my enemy will be my friend. But don't turn your back on him. I'm not going to. soldiers. This is the help you promised? That Sandoval promised? A single Yankee died, so you send a handful of soldiers. Hundreds of Bolivians have died from Santa Blanca's bullets. Where will my hundreds of soldiers come from? As Americans, we aren't here, remember? These soldiers are the best covert ops team our country has to offer. With their help, you won't need hundreds of soldiers. Are you familiar with the word Huber, Senora Bowman? Meet Pakatari, leader of the resistance group Kataris 26. We will be working with the rebels to destabilize Santa Blanca's organization. They've been fighting Santa Blanca and corrupt Bolivian officials for nearly six years now. We'll need to coordinate targets. There is no time for this. We have information on Amaru's whereabouts. Amaru? You found him? Amaru is one of the founders of the Kataris 26. More than that, her group is founded on his ideas. Without his theories of an agrarian proletariat, there would be no organized resistance against Santa Blanca and the corruption in our government. Amaru must be saved. If you were to assist my people, it would do much to earn my confidence. Where is he? We do not know exactly. We know he is in this province and that there is a Santa Blanca lieutenant who knows where he is. I'll put a call into the activity, see if they can dig more intel out of the airwaves. Start looking for that lieutenant and keep me informed of everything via sap phone. Good hunting. Saving Amaru is important to our cause, Yankee. Make sure you don't kill the Santa Blanca lieutenant before you get the chance to ask him questions.
right here, man. Before you know who it is, you play part of the real gamer, man. We on this uh, Wildlands. I got TGZ in here. <coughs> and we about to see what's about to go down. Now, he's played this already. Well, at least the beginning of it, for sure. <coughs> now, on this channel, I might be popping in here with different people. As far as on this game. Today we got Tristan, or TG's mobile, Tristan and Don. <coughs> and he currently doesn't have a mic right now. Oh, shoot. Switch to suppressors. You got a suppressor on your gun, Doc? Oh, okay, we can use the drone. Drone is airborne. I'm looking at a small group of tangos. I'm checking it out right now, Tristan. Oh. Eyes in a small group of tangos. That's one less bad a guy. Small group of tangos. Good eyes on the target. Let's move. Yeah. <clears throat> you killed him already? Dang, dude. He already did this. So he trying to move all ahead. <clears throat> oh, you ain't did this? Inter interrogate him. Don't kill him. Shit, they see us. Fucking hell. I got 
gotta get a sight on this dude. Oh, I died, nigga. <clears throat> Come on, man, because you started this firefight. He in the room behind you. Hey, let him go. Let him go. We gotta interrogate this dude. And you don't know how. Silencio, Marche. Here's the deal, asshole. You answer my <coughs> questions, or I put a bullet in your gut and leave you to die in your own shit. No enciendas? Chill the fuck out, cabron. What do you want? Amaru, where can I find him? <laughs> you serious? That's what this is about? Sure thing? He's at Atoya Farm. Go on. Then you can see what we do to people who fuck with us. People like you. <clears throat> oh, man. Don't shoot him. We need to get this done in a hurry. Amaru's an old man. He's not going to last long under torture. Shit, if they've been working on him for a while, there's a good chance he's already dead. Maybe, maybe not. Amaru is a major. <clears throat> <sighs> These supplies will buy us a lot of goodwill from the rebels. Let's get back on mission. Oh, okay. Where you at? Dude, you Let's went all the way down the hill, the cartel bro. isn't going to wait around for us to track down and rescue Amaru. Nope. Take the short way down, boy. <clears throat> You're doing too much, son. Come on now. Damn, that's gonna hurt in the morning. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hold on, man. There's some stuff that I gotta get. That you just ran off. I gotta fix these weapons. Oh, you gotta earn that shit, huh? Ah. <clears throat> okay. Well, I guess that shit doesn't matter then. Be like Call of Duty for real. Did you get a car, man? I'm on my way then. Are you going the right way, man? Stop. Get out the car. Get out the car. Oh, okay. Then I should have been driving then. <clears throat> Don't waste your ammo, bro. Guy. 
But that's the business, you know. One day you're having jealous with a guy con un carnal. The next day, you're giving him a turpentine and Sicarios are ex-military. ID your targets. Hold on. Tomorrow gets killed by a stray round. Get the, uh... Operation Kingslayer. Don't go yet, boy. Before it even starts. Let's go. I gotta mark him on here first. See a second target. I got a third. Oh. Shit. I don't know how to crouch, bro. Oh shit, they shooting us in the back, dog. Oh, these niggas is ready. <clears throat> I'm down, man. What's up? Man, these mugs ain't even on the call of duty. I'm dying, dude. <clears throat> yeah, you the one going ahead, bro. That's why you died. This this is this is a time thing, man. This ain't like Call of Duty and you die and you come back. I just gotta get used to the shooting. <clears throat> Mine is still loading, son. So, circle is how you get down. I was getting shot in the back from the street, man. People who was in cars. What? Oh, I see him. <clears throat> oh, 
We can't mess with them yet. I'm not even ready to battle that kind of group. Then I got free aim on. All right, you need to slow down until I can get this drone to mark these people, son. So crouch. I'm trying to mark everybody. The drone is up. Eyes on a small group of tangos. I'm looking at a small group of tangos. Eyes on a small group of tangos. I'm looking at a small group of tangos. <coughs> Enemy killed. You started shooting, bro. Shit balls. Frag out. Target eliminated. Hold up. There's a weapons case here. All right, hold on. I'm going there yet. Are you Are Amaru? What's left of him anyway? Come on, we're getting you out of here. Nah, <clears throat> uh -uh, I'm flying, nigga. I'll pilot. What is this dude waiting for? That's why I told you not to answer this dude, because he's not even getting in the fucking helicopter, dog. Dang, what is he doing, bro? Oh, I gotta lead him on here. Okay, that makes sense. <coughs> he need to get his ass on this helicopter. He doing too much. Where are you taking me? Back to your friends. Entonces, Pac Katari has made his deal with the malditos extranjeros, the young fool. Take it up with him, senor. <clears throat> Boy, I know how to fly a helicopter. I play Grand Theft Auto. Look like this man got shot up, though. He's smoking pretty bad. Santa Blanca is not the most gracious of hosts. <coughs> these Aucas, these demons, they had questioning me. Let us say 
Their talk of love was enough to make me vomit. But their methods were not... We're not... Son, I'm recording right now. Were their names Yuri and Polito? Si. Yuri and Polito. These are the fucks that tortured Ricky Sandoval with when you questioned him. I want them bad. We only saw run-of-the-mill Sicarios when we freed Amaru. But I haven't seen Yuri and Polito in at least three days. Maybe four. I don't know where they are now. We need more intel. We'll search every village and camp until we find something. Somebody's gotta know something. Gather documents, hack computers, interrogate hostile <coughs> lieutenants, talk to civvies, whatever it takes. We'll turn over every rock. Alright, man, you know who it is, your boy Paul, the real gamer, man. Mission complete. First Good mission job. out the Bowman's gate. File and Yuri and like and subscribe to through. the channel, man. Hit that notification and get the latest. And we're gonna have more of this. Um... That's the rundown on like Yuri and Alfredo. <coughs> They're a key part of Santa Blanca more security operation. More of this operation. Ghost Recon coming Remember out. Remember to check out Bowman's briefing on the chain of command. Guy in charge of security is El Murrow, the Until wall. Until next time. Personal bodyguard and childhood friend.